Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for coming back. So if you see this outfit once again, that means you saw my other video, my get ready with me for my birthday, and this is just a continuation of it, adding more content to my YouTube for the first time. Um, so I wanted to talk to you guys about the wig I'm wearing today. This is the Zelina wig by Sensational. She's been everywhere, so I know you guys have already seen her. Um, so she comes in a few different colors on the back. I have her in Thin Blue Odge. Thin Blue Odge. Thin Blue Odge? Thin Blue Odge. Sounds weird. Thin Blue Odge. Sand, which is like a ash blonde, and then it has like some lighter blonde pieces in it. Um, and then this is the inside of the stock card. It says it's pre-plucked. And the hairline's undetectable, but... Tell me again. Tell me again. Um, I just plopped it on because I just wanted you guys to see how it looks. Um, uh, okay. Yeah. So I'll insert pictures of this wig also um they're probably before yeah I'll insert pictures of the wig um but so the only thing I have an issue with I got it and it has like a track that's back here I'll I'll post a picture like right here that is like I don't know like coming out and I can't find my needle and thread like I can't find my needle to like sew it down so it's like lumpy right here no one else has had that problem so I don't know if this was just like a bad batch or what I ordered two of them because hair so fly had the mocha one and they didn't have this one so I ordered the mocha one and then they restocked and got this one so I, I uh, ordered this one also um uh, but yeah, that's the only like thing that I don't like and then the hairline they I know they said it's undetectable But I can see it and I know you guys can see it and I tried to blend it as much as I could with my powder but Yeah, so I don't know But other than that, it's a very pretty wig. I hate that it keeps having this little side issue which I know a lot of synthetic wigs has but, but whatever it's a very soft texture the curls are i'm speaking too fast the curls are very beautiful i like how it sits anyway it's kind of like an everyday wig not like every day but like if you're going out for like probably one night only because i don't see it this lasting any longer than that because of the texture but it does give you very voluminous um curls And then this came in a center part, but I just pushed it to the side. I don't know if I'll keep it that way, but I might because of the hairline. I'm going to have to work on the hairline. I might have to pluck it, even though it says it came pre-plucked. I don't know. I may have to make it a little bit more jagged. I don't use baby hairs, so that could also be my problem. Maybe I'll use baby hairs. I don't know. I don't think so, though, because I don't really like it. Maybe I'll have to use like a different, um, um, like a darker powder. I use my bronzing powder because that's the powder that's closest to my hairline, not my face powder. But you can still see it and I know if I take pictures you'd be able to see and I just have to like Photoshop it. Or not Photoshop but Facetune it and I don't really hate doing that to my wigs because I want them to be what they are but if you did just plop it this is what it would actually look like again I don't really like baby hairs but I might just add them because the wig just looks weird without it and I don't know if it looks weird because of the hairline or it just looks bad I don't know um and then I'll probably add powder to the part so it can be a little bit more defined but I just really wanted to show you guys what this wig looked like I'm probably gonna play with it 
and then come back to show you guys because it just looks weird and last time I had a wig like this I just ended up cutting a majority of the lace off so that it wouldn't have excess lace in the front so that this wouldn't happen because the lace was like damn near white and I'm dark skin and that doesn't look <laughs> good on me maybe if I were a more light skin it would have melted better but it doesn't I also had that problem with uh forgot the name of the wig I'll insert a picture here but that wig but it still looked better than this wig does in pictures so I don't know I'll be back though because I just need to fix this and maybe I will maybe I'll like it better yeah I'll be back okay guys so I'm back I added powder to the part and I added more powder to the front like a darker powder um, and I just plopped it back on my head um, I don't know I don't know I don't know I don't know. Maybe I love the colors in it. Like, look at that blonde piece. It's so pretty. I don't know. I mean, it looks better. It doesn't look as detectable. I can tell you that. I guess these are one of the wigs you have to put the effort in. I don't know what. I'm trying not to swear. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with these curls, but and I don't want to like do too much to them so that they don't, you know, because I want them to be be cute. But oh, I don't know. And I kind of wish this was a little bit longer. I feel like some people's wigs look a lot longer, but then I'm like, I'm sure I know no one's on YouTube shorter than me. <laughs> um. <sighs> I don't know, guys. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about her. I don't know. I feel like she is a lot of work, though, I tell you that. And you know I don't like to do a lot of work with my wigs. Okay, but yeah, so her specs, she has like, she has two combs on the side, one comb in the back, adjustable strap. She fits pretty snug on my head. Again, I cut all my hair off so there's no braids or bulkage. So if it's bulky, it's just a wig. It's not me. There's nothing under there. Like I said, there's a track right here that is coming out. And I don't know. It feels like they fried the hair in this area. I don't know what's going on there, but it's not laying down very nicely. I was gonna go buy a hot comb, but Sally's, the Sally's that I go to said they didn't have any, so I just used a flat iron to flatten it down as much as I could for until I get an actual hot comb that could help a girl out. Um, but she's a cute wig nonetheless. Her colors are beautiful. She sits nicely. She goes past my boobs if you stretch her out, and then if you're not, it's just, like, at the boob. So I guess that's what, like, 18-ish inches. I don't know. I don't know how I feel, girls. And then this is what she looks like on the side. And this side. And throwing the hair back. 
she doesn't feel like she has any tracks showing. So that's good. And then you can part her any way, whether you want to part her on this side, the middle, or the other side. You can do that also. Maybe I'll try her as a center part. I really don't want to. Like, I want to have... I did a center part last year for my birthday, so I'm trying to do something different. <laughs> ah. Um, yeah. I don't know, y'all. I don't know what's going on. But she's cute. She's cute. Like, she'll get the job done. Like, if I wear her for one, two nights, like, if I just wear her for the weekend, like, she'll get the job done. Um, so, yeah, I think, I think that's it. I think this is, the video's over. Um, she doesn't shed. Well, I only combed her. I didn't, um, brush her out. I just combed her with this comb and then I just finger curled it out or brushed it out finger curled uh finger brushed it out so I'm not getting any snaggage which is fine let me know if you guys would want like an updated video about my way and then this is gonna be my last brush test because I didn't want to the curls bothering the crap out of me. <laughs> so it's okay. I don't know what is going on. But her curls bounce right back, so that's nice. But yeah, that's it. This is her. This is how she be. She's cute. She gets the job done. All right, guys. So that wraps up my video. Um, should I rate her? I think she's like a seven because track's coming out in the back. The curl over here is acting them up. She's acting a fool. Irritating my soul. She will look cute in photos. She took a lot of things to do, and I don't like that. You know, I like flop and go. Um, so, yeah, I think that's it. So, I will wrap this video up. I thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in another video. You probably can still see the lace. I try to blend it as much as I can. I don't glue my wigs down, so maybe that's a problem I'm having. But sue me. <laughs> I'll see you guys in another video. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Bye, guys.